are listening to Gorgas, you idiot. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. There's lights in my shirt. <laughs> and they're fucking distracting me, <laughs> but they look so goddamn pretty. You're, Yay. <laughs> you're, you're like a cat with a fucking laser pointer trying to pay attention during the pod. I know. I'm all like connected. Here, um, wait. Can you show people the light on the sweater oh, that yeah, I bought you? That's fucking sick. Yeah. D- d- Merry Christmas. Thank Merry you. Christmas, buddy. Look Ooh. at that. Look at that. <laughs> yeah, there you go. <laughs> Look at that, dude. That's hot, dude. Is it, are we getting that on the pod, Tony? Oh, Merry nice. Christmas, Tony. 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 I Merry haven't Christmas. seen you in many moons, dude. Since the last time we did a pod yeah. together. Oh, man, what a which monumental was at, day. Which was at? That dude, was it was a domino effect. It was the day that started it all. Here, you need to, like, yeah, I need this yeah, one yeah, down. Crank this one. Oh, my yeah. fucking God, dude. <laughs> I'm never on this side of the fucking... Look at me, dude. I'm I never know. on this side of the fucking table. It looked like... I can't do it. I can't leverage it from there. You're going to have to do it. <clears throat> there you go. Get her down there. Yeah, gotta I got Get it down it. and pipe it up, you know? There you go. That's what... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Got some t- some tuning live on the fucking hell yeah, dude. Just tuning, let him know. Just tuning it live right quick. My boy, Michael Ridley, what's up, dude? Thanks for coming back on the on the Gorecast Christmas edition. Yeah, it's our first uh, our first Christmas edition of the pod. Christmas. We've never done a Christmas pod. Do you like Christmas, dude? I was gonna. That was my first, literally my first question for you. I love Christmas. Do yeah. you Do you like Christmas? Because I you don't... know what I want for Christmas. A big booty hoe. Better arms. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! This Jesus is Christ! Thing. Fine, we'll get it. Yes, sir. We gotta, we gotta fucking. Hey, I didn't buy these in the first place. I Look, cold. Figure this thing and out. And then I'll tighten. There you go. Now you're wow, in position. Dude. Now you're in position. We locked in. All We're right. locked in. Are All you feeling right. good? Oh, well, hold on. <laughs> okay. The Christmas ASMR Ridley okay, podcast. Dude. Do you uh? Do you like Christmas? You have a good Christmas history? A Christery? You have oh. a good? Or do you like? Because some people hate Christmas, and I just don't get I'm that. I'm gonna tell you right now. I do not like Christmas. I fucking hate Christmas. Oh, you Christmas. don't? Oh, okay. no. I, no. Dude, here's the thing. I suck at it. There's, I'm going to tell you right now, dude. Chelsea has like a, Chelsea has like eight gifts that are just chilling. And I haven't had any time to wrap them. Oh, really? Yeah, she's like, you can put them in boxes and I'll wrap them. I'm like, why? You're not going to wrap your own, That t- it's like, that's like taking away wrap from your, your manhood. Gifts. Yeah, yeah. yeah, you can't wrap your own gifts. It's just, it just, I don't know, it's all kind of, a lot of it's redundant to me. I I love everything about Christmas minus wrapping gifts. Mm. I'm like the only Asian person in the world that's not good at folding paper. <laughs> I, feel like if, I feel like if there's anything I should be good at, it's fucking <laughs> origami swan. I can never get this part right. You know what I'm saying? I mean, that I got to be I can honest, I never though, get this part right. For, for I'm going to tell you right now, I can, I can always do this part. Boom! Easy. Put the tape right there. How do you do this part? How do you, how do you do this? This You're is how I do it. it this is how I do it. I go like this, and this, <laughs> and it looks just like that. The corners of the package. It just it's everything. Like a sushi hand roll. Everything looks like it's a soft item. <laughs> soft goods. <laughs> yeah. When I wrap a gift, it could be a rigid. It could be yeah, a fucking a shoe box. Yeah, it's a shoe box. It looks like there's a a throw. Oh my pillow god! Is there. that a sweater? Oh, it's hard in the middle. <laughs> yeah. It just, why does it look like? <laughs> why does it look like there's a throw pillow in here? <laughs> it's the old uh, Christmas switcheroo. Yeah, yeah. You gotta let him keep him guessing at all times. Yeah, my dude. mom fucking my mom would, was excellent at wrapping gifts, and I fucking was like, that's a fucking Pokemon pillow. Yeah. And I opened it, and I was like, it's a Pokemon pillow. So you gotta yeah. keep him guessing. Maybe me sucking at wrapping gifts is a good thing. Did you ever get? Did you ever get like? Uh, did your parents ever get a good switcheroo on you? Like. Like back in the day, my parents would always switcheroo it for me. Like, uh, like yeah, when they got my brother a bike and they didn't get me one, that was a crazy <laughs> switcheroo, dude. <laughs> that was crazy, Santa. The old, the old. The fuck, dude. <laughs> it was a switcheroo because you thought you were the favorite son. It was 1999. This motherfucker had pegs on it. I was like, damn, son. You remember when pegs came out, dude? <laughs> dude, you, dude. Pegs were hot, dude. Dude, pegs. Hey, dude, you want to go to the store? I just got pegs on my mongoose. Oh uh, yeah, that, that, that means. Just you have one, you have one homie. Just holding on to your back like a fucking Fuck, girl on the year. back of a motorcycle. One year, me and my autistic little brother, they ordered a, uh, I guess they ordered this bike from the Philippines, and it was super funny because it's like, it was a normal bike, right? But it had a sidecar on it, and then of course, like those I'm old the Vietnam older, motorcycles. Or yeah, something? it looks like a little, like a, <laughs> <laughs> it was exactly a bicycle. like that. <laughs> 
It was a bicycle with a super wide back axle and a fucking sidecar <laughs> on the back axle, which is funny because I'm the older brother. So that means, guess what? I'm never going to get to ride in the sidecar, dude. I'm oh, always the one. You're always got to pedal. You got to pull the weight. The you're always pulling the weight. And I'm 30 years old and I'm still waiting to get my turn in the sidecar, dude. My little sidecar. brother. Yeah, dude. We should get you a little like Honda motorcycle with the sidecar. And you can dude. drive and wear like a little army helmet. And I'll drive the motorcycle. Oh, uh, dude, yeah, yeah, yeah. Just make that, make that. Yeah, come, dude, I just want to be you. the guy in the sidecar for once. I'm always no, but now the motorcycle, that motorcycle, that's fun. If I'm the sidecar, then then I'm the retard. <laughs> Hell yeah. Hell yeah, dude. All right, we'll just be. Are you uh? So you don't? You're not a Christmas hater though. Like you don't like gift wraps, but you're not like fuck Christmas. Christmas sucks. No, nah, Christmas rules. <sighs> dude, but who are these people that fucking hate? Who are these negative Nancys that just hate Christmas? I don't get it. I don't know, Scrooges. Dude. Grinches If I, got, if I got finger blasted by Santa Claus in the early 90s, I'd be pissed, too. Santa sure. Santa has to be fucking people over. You mean like mall Santa or real Santa? I mean like real Santa. I think maybe somebody... How many kids do you think have the same name? And there's just a kid with your name fucking up. Oh, then, yeah. How many times how do is you, that? How does Santa keep <laughs> yeah. the fucking yeah. files straight? Yeah, dude? yeah. How does he know? Like, I know... I, I question the integrity of the list, St. Nicholas. <laughs> Tell us. How, you question, keep, how do you keep everything straight? How do you keep the... Well, how do we straight? please this fickle God? <laughs> 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 he carries so much weight on our shoulders. He like, is the all... He is the great decider of who is naughty and who is nice. <laughs> Two very object, objective subjects. Very objective... They're so objective. Could you naughty imagine if Santa, nice. if Santa based the naughty and nice list off of uh, who shit their pants that year or not? <laughs> oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Michael, you've been quite a naughty boy. <laughs> and by naughty boy, I mean 30-year-old man who still poops his pants. Oh, 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 and you're like, Santa, no, I haven't shit my pants all year. <laughs> and he opens the list. Oh, well, let's see. May of May 14th. <laughs> September 6th. There's the yes. Yeah, yeah. Every date that you've shit your pants. But that was just a little bit in the car on my way home. That one time you were at the DMV and you were running late and you went there anyways. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. He's like, but Santa, I haven't shit my pants this year. He does this. He's like, <laughs> <laughs> Check again. <laughs> Why? Why would you do this? Ho, ho, ho. And just fucking. Oh, he makes you shit your yeah, pants Yeah, he fucking magic. twists his nose or whatever the fuck he does. I'd get you some coal, but you already have some in your drawers. <laughs> <laughs> oh, check it. Yeah, yeah. Check Check your drawers for a lump of coal. Ho, ho, ho. Yeah, a lump of shit. Yeah. <laughs> Merry Christmas, you fucking filthy animal. Oh, filthy animal. Do you have any uh, favorite Christmas memories, like uh, of like getting a gift? On yeah, Christmas? me and my brother woke up real early one Christmas morning. Was, I think it was uh, Christmas in '99. We woke up mad early, son. I'm talking like six in the morning, Christmas morning. Ooh. We couldn't wake anybody up. Couldn't wake anyone up. So I wake my brother up. Also, I pissed my pants. I pissed my pants Christmas morning. <laughs> I woke up. I woke up. Pissed the bed. I was like, all right, cool. You're like, sick. Change my clothes. <laughs> Getting started early. Yeah, 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 yeah. Change my clothes, throw them in the hamper or whatever, wake my brother up, run downstairs, and we just open every Christmas gift before anyone wakes up. <gasps> we just, wo- we just, op- I mean, I'm so op- That's naughty list behavior, dude. Yeah, I, I open up my dad's uh, stuff. I'm opening up shit that's not even mine. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just like, oh, dude, sick. He got a fucking- You're just like a dog that yeah. got into the mail. <laughs> yeah, I'm like, sick. My dad got a dope-ass Wilson leather jacket for Christmas. That's cool. He's going to be super hype when he comes down here to see that. <laughs> well, I'm a kid. I'm like, well, I mean, I might as well open everything yeah, and get doing everything all ready. The work yeah, in my them. in my brain, I'm like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm 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 doing a good thing. I'm helping everybody out. I'm opening their gifts for them and I'm setting it and making piles and being like, here's what Santa brought you. Here's what Look, look. And I was going to show everyone I have a Filipino mom. Okay? And she uh, she wanted to record the reactions like every other normal parent does because right. she balled out, son. I'm talking. Po- oh yeah, Pokemon Silver, Pokemon oh, Gold. Stop. Yeah. And you guys were just Pokemon already playing Pokemon action figures. You were just playing the games. And Buzz, the up. uh, movie, movie uh, accurate. Buzz and Woody. 
Buzz Lightyear, the, like the action figure. Mm-hmm. Oh my god, that like was so movie, big. Movie accurate, like and press all the, the fingers moved and yep, shit. Yep, Dude, yep. I remember you that. Press, you press the red button and the wings shoot out the sides. Yeah. You fucking got the Woody. There's a snake in my boot. There's a fucking right. Yeah, it was. And all, Toy Story was hot. That was hot. hard. Those were hard to get. I feel like I pictured. I imagine those were difficult to get without internet and cell phones. And dude, yeah, the mm-hmm. Disney store. You had to go get in line at the Disney store. Yeah. I I like specifically remember how fucked up the mall was trying to get. It was literally fucking Turbo Man from from it, yeah, from yeah. It, like the Buzz Lightyear doll. Turbo Man is based off of I feel like the, the craze the, of the Buzz Lightyear doll. Yeah, like that is legitimately what it was. And boy, when I tell you she beat the shit out of us that morning, <laughs> <laughs> she beat the fuck out of us, dude. She beat the ever living. How, are you, how shit. could you open up the presents? She's first? like, "What did you get for Christmas, huh? What did you get?" She's got a camera. She's holding <laughs> She's the camera. Recording that. What up? did you get for Christmas? <laughs> it buzz. Buzz. You like the Buzz Lightyear? Yes. Say it again. Ah, uh, yes. That's, that was that Christmas. We just got beat the shit out of brutally. I would pay so much money to find that tape, just to have that tape, seeing those Dude, I went videos of me crying, getting <laughs> beat by my <laughs> Christmas morning. We should like do it. So we should do a documentary called "Finding the Tapes," yeah. where we go back and try to find your the, mom's tapes of you, and go lost, through your family's yeah. shit, and yeah. try to find it. Try to find all my lost childhood memorabilia. <laughs> you getting your ass whooped on Christmas? Oh, dude, I would love to see that, dude. Another piece of memorabilia I want is my mugshot from jail. I cannot find it online. Really? I cannot find my mugshot. Tony, look up his mugshot. I want it so. <laughs> Newport News City Jail. Newport News City Jail, Michael Ridley. Yeah. <clears throat> it's so hard. I don't know where to find a weed. What, what did you go to jail for? A weed. Just just weed? The weeds. I had too much weeds. I had like 19 weeds on me, and the cops came. 19 grams? Yeah. No, <clears throat> no I had 17 weeds in my... <laughs> I had 17 weeds, and my brother opened the door and let the cops in, and then they raided, their pl- raided our place. A-E-L. And they raided the place, and it was fucking, that was like Christmas, because it was like, oh, look, a surprise, you know what I mean? That was, no, nope, there's me, there's my <laughs> mugshot right there. That's crazy how quickly you found it. Michael Ridley of Newcastle, sentenced to five years of jail. That's not you. That's crazy. Well, I did live in Newcastle for a little <laughs> bit, but I don't think that was me. I'm Michael now. I'm every Michael. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's crazy. Men of Culture, featuring Michael Ridley. Oh, type in, that, type in Asian one. afterwards. <laughs> no, I don't think that's it. I think it's a uh, scroll down. Thirteen News Now, Ridley Circle. Yeah, that's that rough uh, neighborhood in my apartment. What well, <laughs> rough neighborhood in my hometown? I mean, yeah, you're yeah. not gonna. We're be not able gonna to find, find it. it. You would have been able to find it by now. No, yeah, that's what. I'm Do you saying. remember what it kind of looked like? Like the face? You were you really? Like, I was Fuck wearing. You. I was wearing orange, and I think I was crying. Yeah, it's all right. Yeah, we'll never someday find you'll it. find it. We'll we'll have to do a deep scrub of the internet and try to find it's it. It's super hard. Let's yeah. see what Michael Ridley of Newcastle got charged with. Yeah, go back. <laughs> see what this other Mike is. He still centered up in the shot, Tony, or does he need to scoot over a little bit? Just a little bit towards him. Toward him, just a just a hair, There's just a, a rabbit's foot. Oh, oh, see, it was just yeah. a barely just a slice. All right, cool. Um, new. What is this? It was the first list. The first on the one. Screen. The very first one. Very top. Michael Ridley of Newcastle. What did he go to jail for? I mean, yeah, him. Whoa, that's crazy. Man, that sucks. That guy has He looks the exact just same. like you, dude. Yeah, let's chill for a second. You know? He's a boxer. Michael Ridley. All right, let's read this. <laughs> yeah. uh, let me read this. Michael Ridley, who had taken cocaine, Down. landed a punch on Sergeant Chris Chaxfield <laughs> 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 and attacked his wife, Adele. Damn, dude, I remember one. Yeah, this was back when me and Adele were seeing each other. <laughs> well, they were on a night out in Newcastle in the early hours of May 31st. Yeah, May's my birthday month. You know, oh, he fucking crazy. killed that guy, got in a fight with him? And- S- Sergeant Chaxfield, a veteran of Iraq, I- Afghanistan, and the Balkan conflicts, died three days later. Ridley, 22, admitted his manslaughter and the unlawful wounding of his corporal w- wife, an army nurse, and was jailed at Newcastle Crown Court yesterday. That's crazy. <laughs> 
That's why is there why? so much, so many nugs on this fucking website? There's dude. ganging nugs. <laughs> the Northern Echo. All right. All right, dude, let's move forward. Let's move on, dude. That dude. Um, so, any other go- any good Christmas memories that were don't involve you getting beaten? Anything? Anything? That wholesome? same Christmas. Oh, that same. Just That's because it. the loot was so. The loot was worth the, the beating. The loot was worth the beating. Okay. Nothing comes free in life. No. Yeah, it was good. That was awesome, dude. Um, did you uh, did you hear about what where what America's getting for Christmas this year, dude? What? The Epstein list is dropping, bro. I thought that already happened. I saw that on Google here. Look Docs. up, look up a new, look up the new article. There's a new. He, apparently, they're dropping like 150, 100 names or some shit on Jan first, dude. <laughs> new drop, fresh drop, dude. Yeah, can we not? What you don't want to go there? No, I don't. I, I don't want you don't you don't. Want, I don't want the list of names. To come <laughs> yeah, out. You're, I was gonna say like you know everybody's like separate the art from the artist when it comes to fucking R. Kelly. Like, can yeah, we I do would, that with with Will with everyone with Will Smith, dude? <laughs> Are you, how can you separate Bill Clinton from his art, dude? Yeah, yeah, it would suck if like my name was on that list. <laughs> <laughs> that would yeah. be a nightmare. <laughs> um, I was just trying to vacation. I heard there was good music there. It was a yeah. I was working there as a tour guide. <laughs> 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 on your left, yeah. On your left, you'll see the what booty fuck dungeon. You'll the see. booty fuck dungeon. That's crazy. Is this a new? What are they? What are they releasing, Tony? I thought they already released it. I a saw. Judge it. orders released. No, this is like yesterday. This fucking article came out. Thank God. 150 names of the people, dude. There are some athlete or some. There's some professional. There's some celebrities sweating right now. <laughs> sweating right now. Dude. Tom Hanks. Yeah. <laughs> they're trying to they're trying to enjoy their right. last Christmas before they get outed as being on the Epstein list. Fuck those motherfuckers. <laughs> That's crazy. You know why? Because if you think about it, dude, rich people can have whatever they want. I think that's what it is. They can have whatever they want. And what's the thing that people can't have? <laughs> Kid pussy. Kid pussy. <laughs> they're Kid like, ass, you know dude. what? Yeah, it's like it's like the caviar of be of sex to them. It's <laughs> fucking being a pedophile is like like wow, look, this is such high end. This is so fancy. Wow. It's the caviar. Of yeah, chill, child sex slaves. Wow, this is so fancy. Mm. Jeff, you've Jeff, truly you, outdone yourself. You did it again, Jeffrey. <laughs> yeah, this you, is crazy. Yeah. There's just a guy walking around with a plate of kids. Yeah, plus the scenery. <laughs> like, yeah. Yeah. Anybody want some adrenochrome shots? Yeah, oh my god, dude, fucking uh Hillary's there in her true form. Just <laughs> she took the skin suit yeah, off. She's just there in her true. <laughs> yeah, she's there. Oh, Mrs. Clinton is. Uh, <laughs> yeah, Mrs. Clinton. It's such an honor to meet you. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness gracious! Is that? <laughs> you think they ever did Christmas on the island? Oh god! <laughs> just a happen? Jimmy Jimmy Buffett live in concert from Epstein Island. They just have the like, kids dressed up like fucking some children. <laughs> <laughs> They don't know their parents. They've lived on this island their entire lives. <laughs> but fucking some children. Blim, 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 blim. <laughs> they have them all dressed up like the reindeer, like attached to a straight. Yeah, it's, it's terrible. Fucked. Yeah, it's terrible. Hopefully, uh, I'm, I'm wondering what, who's going to be on the list, dude. Mm. That's going to be a juicy list. Mm. Dan Schneider. <laughs> yeah. The guy who made uh, we had no idea. Yeah, Dan Schneider, the guy who made uh, Drake and Josh, The Amanda Show. Oh yeah, uh, creepy what else? dude. Yeah, uh, I heard Harley. Will Smith was on the the, the flight logs. Oh uh, yeah, that's Will gonna Smith. ruin that's gonna ruin Men in Black for sure. Yeah, they're all part of it. They're all part of it, dude. Um, hell yeah, dude. So uh, what do you want for Christmas this year? Ridley? You already gave me a gift this oh. year. You gave me some shoes. You've been in feeling in the spirit, I feel like. I want a car. You want a car? Uh, yeah, I want a car that fucking works. Are you going to buy yourself a Miata? Nope, I'm not. You're not going to do it? Nope. I don't know what I'm getting for Christmas, honestly. You got some presents under the tree? Have you shit your pants this year? Yeah, I have, actually. Oh, shit, you're on the naughty list, dude. The, 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 the shardy shit, list. Shit my pants. <laughs> Um, dude, I uh, I pulled some stuff to look at. We can start there. Let's let's mess around with some stuff here. Here, Tony, you want to swipe the screen for me? I know. So I got you a little Christmas gift because I know how much you love uh, public freakouts. You know. Yeah. Oh yeah, he's getting rid of the hat. He's got a. I can't. Dude, it's, it's it's a it's, it's a squeezing hot. the. It's like <laughs> it's const- hot. It, no, here's the thing. <laughs> I I get it. Like oh, it's Christmas, right? And you wanted me to do this, and I, I love you to death. Just, but 
the hat is like constricting my brain and I'm sucking at this podcast. Right? It's squeezing my brain and the thoughts can't come out. My head is too big. Dude, my head's too fucking big. My dome has felt like when you shove your cock at the very tip into a condom and it gets all like, <laughs> you know, when your dick like forms to the attention of the latex. That's what my head's felt like. I felt my dome slowly coning up for the last 20 minutes of this podcast. <laughs> Jesus Christ. You feel, feel better, dude? Dude, I'm so much welcome better. Welcome, dude. Thanks so much better. Thanks for coming better. on the podcast. Yeah, Let's I felt like a on. lion with a fucking thorn in my paw. Hit just the trying. intro again. Yeah. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> God damn it, dude. My head is too big. I got a big ass Asian dome. Dude, dude your your noggin is just so dude. full of 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 good riffs. It's full of it's yeah, full it's, of riffs. It's full of information. Busting you know what it's full seat. of? 150 people on that list. Yeah, I know exactly. them all by heart, dude. I already know. <laughs> <laughs> there we go, dude. Woo! God the damn. boy can breathe. Maybe I should take yeah. mine off, too. Ah, dude, get maybe rid of take, it. Maybe the sweaters take... are enough. Oh. Oh, that Doesn't does that feel, feel that, that does so feel nice. much fucking better? That actually does feel than these a lot hats nicer. that were designed for small Asian children. <laughs> what size is this, dude? I don't know. Whose head? Whose head is this small, bro? Goodness gracious! Maybe that's why I always feel like shit at Christmas. I always wear these to Christmas. Yeah, the, it's all the fucking lead from the factory seeping into your skin. <laughs> <laughs> fucking <laughs> the Chinese factory that sprayed those with chlor- <laughs> <laughs> the embalming fluid before they got shipped here. All right, you better now. Are you with oh, us? Much better. Yeah, there Good. we go. Okay, All right, cool. I'm here. So as I was stuff. as I was saying, I I pulled some. Uh, I know how much you love public freakouts. So for Christmas for you, I pulled some funny, um, just a couple. Uh, Ooh, we're at Reddit. Good ones. First of all, I want We were Classic. talking. We were talking about good Christmas stuff. I wanted to watch this because this is a good memory. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude, that was me for sure. <laughs> I forgot about the edits that they put in there. Little, little does that little girl know she's about to get fucking wombo comboed in Super Smash Brothers for the next <laughs> oh, five yeah. summers. She'll never beat she's, her brother. No, she's good. Goodness gracious, he's gonna get so fucking good. <laughs> <laughs> yes, dude. Hell yeah. When you just want to fuck touch your presence like that, dude. Yeah, <laughs> yeah look at that, dude. What is he's praying to the, the video game gods right now. He's, Thank you. No, he's like, dude, white power. <laughs> <laughs> look at this young look at this look young white. Da- my dad taught me this in the garage. <laughs> yeah, look at this young white supremacist getting an N sixty four on his birthday. <laughs> New article. Why the N sixty four was inherently racist. Oh yeah, here we go. <laughs> Dude. Yeah! <laughs> That's fucking awesome, dude. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> oh, now we can get shit, games from, from Blockbuster. Blockbuster. Wow, we're Damn. old fam. We are. We're old fam. We're old family. Do Blockbuster. You remember going shit? down to the, you and your dad go down to the Blockbuster, <laughs> rent a video game, get you a movie. Be like, <laughs> it's mine, isn't it? <laughs> And then chat behind the counter and say something like, no, bro, you got to bring it back in like three to four days. Be a <laughs> just British blockbuster. Yeah, for... Did they even have that? Fuck no. They had like, I don't know what the fuck British ha- Brit- Britain has, but they always have like the shittier version or whatever we have. God damn it, dude. I love, you know what I love? I love being an American during Christmas time, dude. Oh, yeah, brother. The fuck are British people getting for Christmas? They ain't never, spotted people, dick, <laughs> <laughs> spotted dick, and fucking bean toast. I've got you your favorite. Yeah, they, they're getting their invitational letter to Hogwarts for Christmas. Yeah, there's <laughs> like, no there's no British version of the N64 kids screaming. You know, fuck no. Um, all right, get out of this, Tony. <laughs> fucking uh, N64 kid, dude. Blockbuster. That's crazy. Oh yeah, let's see this. Uh... Asian people gambling. <laughs> this was me at Skankfest. fuck Jesus. fuck Jesus. Fuck Jesus. Is he trying to plead with the devil to make him win? <laughs> oh, fuck Jesus. Fuck, what did Jesus do, dude? He's 
fucking so mad. I don't know why this is a Christmas video. Maybe it was just like filmed during. Do you know how, how hard it is for him to earn money? <laughs> and then he's just blowing it all in the slot machine. Do you know how many bowls of pho, pho he had to make? To fuck it? <laughs> That's a Chinese guy. Never mind. You know how many pounds of T-Sos he had to move? Yeah, you know how many pounds of T-Sos he had to sling all over the hood? He had to sling so much beef and broccoli just to watch it all go away in a matter of seconds. <laughs> That's crazy. I'd be pissed, too. Dude. Just sweating his ass off in the back room of that fucking Chinese restaurant with that big-ass walk day in, day out. Just Gets, think. Takes a little bit of the fucking overhead from his... <laughs> takes a little bit of the overhead out of his business, and he's like, oh, we're going to get out the hood with this one. <laughs> and fucking six hours later, Jesus! Fuck Jesus! He looks it's, like he's in the Vegas airport. Yeah. <laughs> like, Don't ever fucking game on the Vegas right. airport, dude. I watched a guy win like fucking seventeen hundred, and then like got his money. He's like, it was so funny. I watched this dude win like seventeen hundred in the little smoking sections of the Vegas airport, and he's a uh, the lady's like pulling up like the little uh, attendant lady. She's like verifying it, and it's taken like a little too long, and he's so chill. This motherfucker, this was a this motherfucker was bad, dude. He was just like, <laughs> like not amped at all. Just like just, and he won how much? Like seventeen hundred dollars on the fucking Buffalo, oh, like, yeah, you know yeah, those games, yeah. the fucking the, the screen, slot machines, yeah, yeah Buffalo. It was that one. It was he like he's a fucking Native American, yeah, the Native American fucking gypsy box or whatever the fuck it is. But it's like <laughs> Buffalo, and you press the fucking picture of a deer, and you. I don't understand how that shit works, but the dude won seventeen hundred dollars, and he's just like sitting there twiddling his no thumbs with his carry on around his shoulder, and he goes, "My plane's taking off soon. I need you guys to figure this out." <laughs> it's like I was like, bring me my chips. You don't even fucking deserve it, dude. I'm like down 500, <laughs> like ready to go home, pissed. And this guy's just like, <laughs> how many guys have ruined Christmas because they bet the house on oh, fucking roulette, dude, dude. Dude, dude? My wife's gonna kill me. Oh, I don't man. understand how people get addicted to gambling like that. I do because I've never fucking won anything off gambling. Uh, that's the thing. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah me it only neither. Takes once. I didn't get addicted to gambling until I fucking won. <laughs> like, Did you have addicted to addictive gambling problems? No, I just I play. I'm not even a good gambler. I just play the dumb ones. I go well if I I do like I do scratcher tickets and slots. <laughs> <laughs> that guy. That's a video of old me. <laughs> You're at the Seven Eleven. Fuck. No, we don't even do that, dude. You just scratch where the barcode is, and then you give it back to the guy, and mm. then he'll. I've done. I just do it like that. I'll buy fifty of them and be like, "Here, scan all these," or I'll scan them all individually. If it's a loser, I throw it away, and then I look at how much I spent, and then I'll get like two hundred off the scratchers. I spend fifty, get two hundred. I'm like, re-roll. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, <exactly. laughs> and then you end up it's with not, nothing. It's not that I won hundred and fifty bucks. It's oh, I have a hundred and fifty dollars to re-roll, <laughs> re-roll, run it back. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We're run doing that, it again. Run that shit back. <laughs> And then you're down to your last five bucks, and you buy one more, and you lose, right? And you started with fifty, and then you lose that last five bucks, and you go, "Well, I can. I guess I can start another fifty bucks. We'll try it all over again." <sighs> I know there's one down the line. There's there's a scratcher ticket down the line of that spool yeah. with a smooth five hundred or a thousand dollars on it. And that's how they that's starts, how they get dude. you. Yeah, that's, that's how they get you. You get one little medium win, and then you're like. Oh, that means a big one's down the line, People especially with scratcher tickets. Because I saw that fucking thing about the lady figuring out the algorithm. There's like the algorithm of like the math equation of the scratchers. Payout. Yeah, yeah. They're they're printed in a roll. They're printed in a sequence, and if you buy enough, you can learn the sequence. Is what this lady did. So, so she was counting cards, but with fucking scratcher tickets. Yeah, she was counting the. She she like. Hacked to the sequence. She figured out what the pattern was. The it's Fibonacci like, sequence. Yeah, if it's like loss, dude. loss, loss, small win, loss, 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 big win, loss, 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 grand prize, something like that. Imagine it being like that. So, this is how you get addicted to gambling. You convince yourself that you've got it figured out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, no, but wait. This I can I see know. the I can see the numbers floating around and shit. I'm like, fifty thousand dollar prizes on this one. Fuck. Yeah. <laughs> Damn it. That's goes, the thing is you can't figure it there out. There goes rent. Oh, dude. It's never been, it's never been that bad. I ruined Christmas again. It's never been that bad, but I have, oh, God, I just get on a little winning streak, and then I get on a losing streak, and I'm like, yeah. 
We'll see it through. The gambling guys are the we'll most, some we'll of the most down bad addicts, I feel like. like yeah, because you're fucking just blowing cash super, like, irresponsible amounts of money. It's robbery, really. It really is. Dude. At least if you just buy a bunch of shit, you're, you're at least gaining assets, even <gasps> if they're, you know, useless shit. It's like, at least you're, like, buying material things that, mm -hmm. if you're going to blow your money that way, mm -hmm. it's better than fucking just blowing it on not fucking winning your money back yeah but then a, ga a gambling addict's mind will be like well yeah i've lost a bunch it only makes sense that i'm gonna hit a get a big win soon right that's that's how it works it's like, coming it's gonna yeah, it's, it's gonna its, it's coming for me the big win is on its way dude and then that's how they lose even fucking more and then you lose track of how much you've lost yeah <laughs> and then you're just like minor wins feel like major th things but the reality is dude you're like down like two three grand yeah are you good dude? my head was itchy yeah <clears throat> from whatever the fuck this is. I'm sorry, dude. It's that, it's that lead. Just... Yeah, it was the lead or the lice, the Chinese lice. That, that, <laughs> the Chinese rice. <laughs> <laughs> Why is there rice in here? The Chinese rice? There's fucking, I don't know what the sorry, fuck. Sorry, dude. I try to do a good thing for Christmas. I try head... to make it Christmassy. And you, no, fuck, you did. You know There's all this shit. There's all this, like, I, I'm over. I brought the mooses. Yeah, it's crazy. Like, I'm so overstimulated. The and, fake gifts, you know? Yeah, like the dude, mall house. I'm sorry that I'm, like, a neurodivergent retard that can't handle all this, dude. I'm, I'm stimming so hard. It's just like, there's so much on the table. Oh, what's in here? There's nothing in here. It's just for show. What is this? A fucking table of lies? What is this, dude? There, I bet there's nothing in Oh, my God. A severed penis. <laughs> there's, you, a, there's a little dick in that it's box. For, it's for you, dude. It's an upgrade from what you're, what you're <laughs> dude, Oh, my God. You shouldn't have. How did you know? How did you know? A slightly... Still small, but a little bit bigger. <laughs> Just fucking... Dude, my buddy brought bought uh bought you know Reed, uh my buddy Reed bought us both gel blasters for Christmas, dude. Reed bought me a gel blaster. No, me and him. I was about to say, dude, I got fucking gel blaster. I have like I fucking. Know. You got to You got I have two pistols and a rifle at the crib. So if you guys are trying to get fucked up, <laughs> we should have at a we Zilker have a, Park. Yeah, dude, we yeah, should have a If you're trying war. to get blasted at Zilker Park, yeah, I'm gonna organize a fucking gel blaster war, dude. Larping, all the, larping, fucking all the kill Tony, uh, all the kill Tony people, everybody, dude, I everyone who's got gel pulled, blaster every, be stoked. Yeah, everyone who got pulled on kill Tony will get fucking. Meet me at Zilker Park. Yeah. Be there at B Square, you fucking pussy. <laughs> Slayer. <laughs> 10 yeah. v 10. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Headshot. Headshot. Slayer. Ow, that one kind of hurt a little bit. Yeah. My eye. We're just sitting in there shooting um, shit in his house because it doesn't, they don't break glass. No, it doesn't break anything. So you can just, we're sitting in there like we have these little light fixtures in our apartments. We're just like pinging them like a shooting ding, 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 range. Ding, ding, yeah, it's like a shooting range, dude. Yeah. And we're shooting um, fucking Christmas ornaments dude. off his tree. And they did did break a Christmas ornament. I was at, I was at work. I was working from home and there was like 400 Blue Jays in the tree outside of my house. So I just load up the fucking gel oh, blaster, no, dude. and I walk out. Well, it's not going to hurt him, but I fucking just start dumping it in the tree. <laughs> and, dude, literally, like, 3,000 birds fly out of the tree, and I'm like, what the fuck? Oh, there were so many. Dude, it was so fucking loud. It was like, you know, insulated walls, everything you're in. You got headphones on, I'm working. I'm just like. <laughs> fucking, dude, but that, layer that 5,000 times. <laughs> Like they're fighting, you can hear them fighting and fucking wings flapping and shit. And I just start dumping in it. <laughs> you know how the fucking yeah, gel yeah. blasters. Cut, 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 cut. And I fucking dude, a fucking like three thousand birds came out of the tree oh, easily. I was like, what the fuck is the going on? The plague is upon us. They never, they've never been back. It's been a year. It's been a year. I've never seen that many yeah, birds. Dude, now you it's brought swirl. war to their home. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They not. Listen, you ain't safe around here, motherfucker. Yeah, no. I got one in the truck. I have a gel blaster in the truck right you now. You just keep one strap. Yeah, it's I like funny. to shoot homeless people. <laughs> I do. I drive. I do drive by shootings of homeless people with a gel blaster. Wake up, motherfucker! Get a job. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we should start doing that. And there's like a sleeping homeless person. Just have like a hundred and ones, and just be like, "Hey, <laughs> Merry Christmas." <laughs> yeah, just scare them. <laughs> Make a bunch of those. Hey. <laughs> Merry Christmas! Just a fucking fat ass stack of ones, dude. <laughs> He's all pissed and shit. He's all pissed and confused. <laughs> you woke me up from my fentanyl slumber. Yeah, dude, I was zonked on some Fenty and you fucking gave me money to buy more. So thank you yeah, so much. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, dude. Yeah, we wake him up. He's like, I really appreciate this. It's a Just guy giving people, like giving homeless dudes fentanyl for Christmas in like a nice, <laughs> in like a nice video. Like today, we're gonna go around and give some stuff to the homeless. <laughs> and he's like, oh. <laughs> 
<laughs> your favorite. <laughs> what? Okay, what's your name? Dale. It's like, all right, Dale, well, we got your favorite here for you for Christmas. She fucking rips it and turns into Popeye immediately. <laughs> <laughs> Popeye. Oh, yeah, just... Whoops, whoops. I thought you just went, uh. <laughs> Yeah, you already uh. know. He already looks like that. <laughs> oh, yeah. He just muscles on the muscles. <laughs> the muscles. <laughs> <Just> fucking. <laughs> Beats the living shit out of us. Like, what have we done? We've made him too powerful. <laughs> run, run. One more hit of fentanyl was all he needed to get to his final form. Yeah, the Green Goblin. <laughs> just Green Goblin. This motherfucker just <laughs> kills all the scientists. <laughs> but it's us, like outside, yeah. giving a guy fentanyl. I always thought we should just do free fentanyl for the homeless. And just, oh, yeah, you know yeah. what I mean? Just uh, let them, you know, let them have at it. F F T H. Like, uh, like, like. Triple F T H. Like, uh, Tony from fucking from the. From Scarface, just to, like throw their head in a pile of it, mm. you know, all you can eat. Mm. I think it'd be good. Mm -hmm. It would solve a lot of problems. Take a line, leave a line. <laughs> <laughs> just take a line, leave a yeah. line. Just... What's it called in Starbucks when you fucking paying it forward? Paying it forward. Paying forward the fentanyl rips. Dude, yeah, I don't even dude. know how you you smoke it. You uh, smoke it. I, think, I don't think you snort I it. I think you can. Uh, I think you can snort it, but you can only do a certain amount. I don't know. Because it'll yeah, kill you. It hurts snorting quick. it. Um, anyway, speaking of fentanyl, let's look at some uh, some more some nice Christmas shopping uh, videos here. I think this one will might flag us. This is pretty funny. I'm just gonna turn the volume down, but cause there's a Christmas song playing. Sky for people. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. They Have you seen this one? Yeah, they yanked a bunch of shit. Oh, did they steal shit? Is that yeah, what Yeah, these the guys are stealing shit. <laughs> they're getting away. See, look, they're zooming in on the plate. <laughs> the way that guy jumps in the cart. So for people just listening, it opened, the scene opens with a guy shoving stuff into the back of his uh, station wagon. And then there's another guy trying to thwart the criminal, it looks like, with a shopping cart, beating him with it. And you know what the best part is? You didn't even notice this, but they're fucking Big Lots shopping carts. So they're stealing <laughs> they're stealing from a fucking Big Lots, which is like notoriously a fucking very cheap place to shop. You can Big Lots fucking rules. I love Big Lots. Everything's so cheap. You can buy a couch, a vacuum, yeah. groceries. It's the weirdest store ever. It's like it's, so weird. it's like a grocery store that's been put in a like a Best Buy shaped building. You're like, what the fuck is this? But the it's ceilings like, are too tall for this place to be a fucking grocery store. Yeah, and a furniture store, and, and it's, Chinese Bluetooth headphones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> some skull candies from 2009. You're There's like, like a little flavor of Dollar Tree in there. It's yeah, like just it a feels, sprinkle of like, Dollar Tree. Yeah, it feels like if you like walked up to a Dollar Tree and like turned the knob up like two notches, and then yeah. like, oh, there's furniture and shit in here. It's the like TVs. the seven dollar store. It is like a $7 store, yeah. So it does feel like Dollar Tree because they have those little as mini shopping carts. And, dude, honestly, I would do anything in the world to throw one of those at somebody justifiably like that guy did. That I love guy, how beat up this car, this Kia is. And you can clearly see the license plate. So they got fucked. FKF2723. Yeah. No, they didn't because you have to this steal a certain amount. And Yeah, this Big happened in San Francisco. So what's he got in here? He's Big got Big Lots has such low prices that they – actually weren't charged with anything. It looks like the air mattress didn't make it, yeah. right? And then so we've got a yeah, shark, a shark va vacuum. What do we have under the tree here this year? We got the shark vacuum. What else we got in there? I love how they somehow got the... Quick, it was like, it's like Star Wars. Shut the door, quick! <laughs> yeah. But we got a shark vacuum. What is this thing here? That's what I'm trying to figure out. I don't know. Can't really make out anything. Just, else it's just it. junk. It's, yeah, it's just literally it's just, all junk. just junk. It looks like maybe forty two dollars worth of shit. <laughs> <laughs> like <laughs> fucking <laughs> destroying this Kia Sorento just thing. Just risking it all. That is a Kia Sorento. Nice. It's dude. crazy that it has. Can a, I get a good job, Taylor? Yeah, yeah. good job. That Thanks, is a. Key, that's exactly what that is. Uh, and it looks like it's already beat up from previous thefts that have got, tried got, to be thwarted. It's got power. Uh, it has a power lift gate too, so he's like pressing the lift gate yeah. button to get yeah. it to <laughs> shut. But the shark shut the is door. the shark is in the the shark yeah, vacuum the shark is in the is way. Fucking... Like the most valuable thing is just hanging by a thread. And what, and what they don't know that shark vacuum is probably not even a cordless one. No, it's not even that good. It's not even a good one, dude. No, it's like literally like this was their fucking Ocean's Eleven. Big Lots grand scheme. It's like, all right, listen, we're gonna pull up. <laughs> all right, boys, here's the job. And he rolls out a fucking like paper map. Yeah, <laughs> like yeah. it just says Big Lots with a square <laughs> and a line. Listen, 
you're going to drive the Kia Sorento around the front. <laughs> Me and Greg, we're going inside. Pete's on the ground. We're going to get a $42 vacuum. <laughs> yeah, exactly. This grand and a couple fucking... other junk things that yeah. we don't even really know. Whatever yeah. we can grab. Yeah, one of those cans that when you open it, a bunch of rubberized snakes fly out of. <laughs> yeah. And, uh, <laughs> and pretzels from a company that you've never heard of before. <laughs> and Greg goes, Greg goes, don't you think that's a little much? Don't you think we're? Don't you think that's a little bit more than biting off more than we can chew? You know what I mean? Shouldn't should we? Do we really need the snakes? Yes, Every time we... I think I'm out, you guys get me right back in. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Forty two dollars for the shit. It's fucking video, dude. Forty two dollars for the shit at Big Lots this it's summer. Bi- it's the big biggest. Lots. <laughs> it's the bigger, bigger risks, bigger scores, bigger big lot, lots, bigger lots <laughs> coming this summer. The big, the big job. The big job, dude. <laughs> Get the air mattress. No, no. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> yeah. It would have been. Would have. We would have gotten out there clean if we would have been able to get the air mattress. Yeah. Um, skiing is a common, like you know, holiday pastime. <laughs> this is a unhinged clip. I fucking love this. It just gets worse and worse. This shit. I don't know if you saw this or not. This but. is fucking. Uh, this is fucking yeah, but no, but the worst day. Dude, dude, we this is in Russia. Yeah, it's a Russian fucking. <laughs> I hear the Russian people freaking out. Shovel the shit. Dude, why, it gets so much worse. Yeah, it speeds up. Yeah. This is why I don't fucking ski, bro. This is Look why at these I people. Love Look at these. <laughs> like, Wait a minute. They got a ditch. Bail. Bail. Oh! Oh! <laughs> See that guy in the yellow just get slung into the fucking edge of the screen, dude? Dude, somebody gets really whacked by this at like the end. Fuka. So for people just, just listening to the podcast, there's a ski lift totally out of control and the part where people, it's like going super fast so people can't get off of it and it's just throwing people off of the fucking ski lift. I think this person gets it really bad. <laughs> Dude, what even happened right there? Oh my God. Look. Soink. Whoa. Dude, it dragged her. She was like caught in there. <laughs> oh, shit. Jesus fucking Christ. So, yeah, I'm never going fucking skiing, dude. I don't know. Russia can never just figure shit out. <laughs> <laughs> I want to see the yellow guy that went flying, dude. Yeah, go back. Yeah, right. Right. There. Here it is, dude. He's not coming yeah, off. Yeah, he's this, on this end. He's right this, there. They he's don't even right. like, they don't even, they're don't facing even, the other direction. They don't know what's going on, <laughs> yeah, dude. Yeah. They're facing what's the other direction. What's all the commotion? <laughs> oh, Brilliant. Shit. It's amazing. Oh, shit, dude. Fuck skiing. You think there'd be a button? Like, emer- like at the <laughs> gas pump, you know, the, the emer- emergency shut off? <laughs> <laughs> dude. Blood! Suka! Suka blood! Russians cussing. Dude, look at these guys up here jumping off early. <laughs> yeah, they, they've already caught wind of what's going on. Could you imagine being... Yeah, look at that guy. <laughs> Those dudes bailing early. They're smart. <laughs> it's gonna stop eventually. Those things will just stack up. Actually, it's like it's been four years. There's still just thousands <laughs> yeah, of those yeah, chairs yeah. just piling up because it's Russia, and they can't fix anything. They probably did it to themselves. Have you ever sang Christmas carols before? No. Dude, look at that. My time, dude. What have you people ever heard of? Closing the goddamn door at all. With my face in the face, these colors. Dude, he is not stoked at all. <laughs> I think. In the Timbs. <laughs> Omi's, Omi's killing it in the Timbs. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. <laughs> it sucks because that dude's literally. If I could ever. Bro, the, here's the thing. The dap kills me. They're so stoked. <laughs> <laughs> the hard cut to him, like, yo. 
No, that dude's wife is naked in the bed, and some, they yeah. rang the doorbell right as he was about to clap cheeks. That is the face of a man who's like, you're wasting my time. I'm yeah. literally about to get some puss right Yeah, here. and the kids are finally asleep, and yeah, they're, they're going to wake a them nap, up. Or they're with a grandma or something, and he's only got a finite time to clap cheeks. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> this, these guys are just pulling up. To I the, pulled out of my wife for these this. Four, yeah, these four <laughs> virgins come knocking at your door to horribly sing Panic at the Disco. <laughs> <laughs> fucking... <laughs> the most un-Christmassy shit. Yeah, with a 44% hard boner trying to hide it at the front door. <laughs> that is what he's doing. He has the dude. body energy of he's... somebody who just pulled their cock out of a pussy and had to answer the door. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. It's like he's he lit- pushing his sweater down over yeah. the fucking yeah, bulge. Yeah, his cock, his cock is upward in his waistband and he's cupping it. <laughs> <laughs> yes, dude. His erection is dwindling the longer he listens Sh- to these Shout tits. out to Tony for finding this one. Yeah, he wasted a blue chew for that. <laughs> He's pissed. He's like, that was my last blue chew. Look at his face. He's so <laughs> fucking just exactly like that. That's, That's exactly so what's going through his mind. I, I know I know what that look. It's like when my dog starts barking at something, you're, you're mid-session. It's like, you guys couldn't have done fucking Jingle Bell Rock? Yeah. Jingle Bell, Jingle Bell, hiding my cock. <laughs> jingle Bell, I was fucking my wife. <laughs> that sucks. Yeah, Shout does. out, Indiana. Uh, this is not Christmas related. I don't know why I found this recently, but this is just fucking hilarious and weird. I can't believe it. we lived in the weirdest time. 2020 was weird <clears throat> as fuck. Say free fries when you get vaccinated. Um, I got vaccinated. You're saying I could get this, you delicious fries. Wait a minute. But there's also a, a burger element to this. These people aren't human. Dude, they're so not human. How the, who the fuck says that? <laughs> When's the last time this guy had a fucking That's a birth? crazy person talking. That is such a... This is how I do it. We got a burger and fries for anyone who's willing to get vaccinated. I'm having mine. I, I got vaccinated and I'm having mine. That's how you say it. You'd be like, yeah, you get a free burger and fries. There's a burger element to it. That's fucking crazy. A burger element to this? <laughs> he sounds like a... Like, like, he sounds like somebody who's trying to review food that he's never eaten before. Yeah. It's funny when they try when they eat the food that the peasants like us have to eat, yeah. the regular people have to eat. Yeah. Oh my god. I don't know what was in that hat, Taylor, but my head is itching like crazy. Really? Yeah. I I'm you're probably gonna have to check me for lice after this. No, there's that's I've only it's only been me that had that hat. There's no lice in the hat, but I'll check you for lice. I got it, yeah. Because I have like a I have a, my scalp is like on fire, dude. What was in this? What, it what could you, just be the wool pull, the fabric. You're what's the a prank on what's me? What's the fabric? No, there's you're no pulling prank. some kind of prank on me? No. What's look at the <laughs> Were your cats in here? I mean, they could have remnant cat hair. Are you allergic to cats on your I scalp? Think, I think on my skin, maybe, yeah. Weird. Fuck. I'm sorry. We're good. I'm sorry. I'll Scratch through, through the hat, dude. I'm a, I'm a professional. We'll get through. <laughs> I have itchy pussy head right now, dude. Let me let me check with Bill Neatart. Is it too early in the day? What's his to... name? No. Bill. This could be Bill. What was that guy's name? Bill Neatard. Neatard? This could be breakfast. This could be too breakfast. Too early in the day to eat a bird. No. Let me let me check with Bill Neatard. Is it too... <laughs> <laughs> I would hate for my name to sound anything like retard. Bill Neetard? Neetard. You know he got fucked with the nice Neetard. Early in the day, need a break. No. This could be breakfast. Okay. Mayor Bill de Blasio. Yeah, you wine. fucking lizard. Yeah, He's yeah, you can eat weird. a burger whenever. He's weird. So you to look at this and think about again. Some people love hamburgers, some don't. Really want to respect all ways of life. But if this is appealing to you, just think of this when you think of vaccination. Mm. Yeah, this is why. The, you see mm. how he's talking to the camera? Could they have This sl- is what the government, these are what the governments think of us. They think that he's talking to the camera like he's talking to... Like a child, special like, needs like kid. Like special needs children. That's what they think of us. Yeah, dude. That's what they think. That shit is so wild. Oh my god. They don't know what level of vocabulary to use because yeah, they think we're all fucking stupid. Some people like hamburgers. Some people don't. Like, when was the last time you fucking did anything human, dude? What have you been doing? You don't know people. Yeah, Mayor I don't know Bill? anybody who's gonna. I don't know anybody who's gonna. Here's the thing, man. You can't. S- you, they want it. They want. He was. That was targeted for all the fat, dumb retards. Like, you're telling me. That's how you're vaccinated. Like, you're working 
Well, not even yeah. Anna Lee. Well, it's funny because all those people, I feel like, w- were already down to to get the vaccine anyway. Mm. Like they're more talking to like people that don't even eat cheeseburgers. They're trying to sell. They're trying to sell that shit to like fucking people like Joe Rogan who won't don't, don't want the vaccine. They're like, you can have a cheeseburger if you want it. It's fucking weird. I don't know. I hate fucking talking about the vaccine shit. I just thought that was hilarious. Did you ever get vaccinated? No. I'm fucking all natural, oh, baby. Yeah, dude. Pure bloods, dude. Pure, pure bloods, dude. Pure bloods, dude. Pure bloods, <sighs> baby. This one's just for you because I know you like car stuff, so right. Tony pulled some car clips for you. I can tell you already like this clip. Yeah, why do you guys go to those things? Can you explain these to these takeover. things to me? It's oh, a takeover. My. People just show up to do donuts and then... Everyone wants to get super close to the car. Why do they want to get close to the car? To get a video. Oh but here's the thing is that <laughs> these are all just complete strangers. I will videotape my boys doing donuts, but it's one car, a very large parking lot, and just me. Right. And he and they don't get very close. And they have bodily harm insurance. If you do get hurt, they can file a claim because you know the guy. But in this case... No, you're just... Like, I've had, I've had tires go past... I've had a car go past my toes, like not over it, but like close. Yeah. Like I've been that close. Damn. And I trust the guy because I know he knows what he's doing Uh huh. and we're good. But this is, that's just like an automatic Lexus that that guy's pressing <laughs> the gas on super hard. There's no controlling what gear you're in. That's why he's spinning out because he and can't. what is he, what is Because there's he? no throttle control, Taylor. They're just pressing the gas super hard and swinging the fuck out but of the But is he filming right now? Is that what it he's looks trying like to do? Yeah, yeah, it looks yeah, like it looks, like, looks he like he's holding it. <laughs> oh, fuck, he got taken out so bad. Wow, dude. Look, go back. He's completely upside down. <laughs> <laughs> his head where his feet supposed to be. He defied gravity, dude. You know, he didn't defy gravity. If anything, he obeyed the fuck out of it. Yeah, that's true. He obeyed the yeah, fuck out of he gravity. He was, he was bowing to physics, dude. He was. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I got to see it one more time. So good. Oh, my God. And he gets up quick. Yeah, because he's fucking freaking out. He's in <gasps> shock. You can see him. He's... Have you ever been hit by a car like that? I'm trying to think. Yeah. No, not like that. But I had that girl open that door on me when I was scooting by. You remember that? Oh, remember yeah. That story? Good God. You can tell it again because people up for my podcast. I was riding my hurt. I was riding my e scooter and somebody swung their door open. Was this here? Yeah, it was here. It was on Sixth. No, it was on Fifth Street or some shit. I can't even remember. It was fucking gnarly, bro. She do- uh, just opened the door and you were in like the bike lane or something, or yeah. you're on the street. Yeah, it was the Uber driver. The Uber driver swung the uh, the Uber driver just he didn't pull over properly. He let passengers out and they didn't check their doors before they opened the door. And the door went right in my leg. And that hurt. And I was only going like 10 miles an hour. Those cars are swinging. You know what I mean? Yeah. Those cars are swinging. Like, that's more surface area that's hitting you. And what happened with the person that hit your car? Was it a guy? The person that hit me? The person that hit you, yeah. With their nothing, car door. Nothing happened. Nothing happened? I didn't press any charges. I didn't call the cops or anything. I was like in between shows at East Austin. Uh, Came back and bombed. Because you just got hit by a car. Came, yeah, I went and I bombed and I was And they haven't had me back since. I got hit by a car. <laughs> <laughs> they haven't asked me to come back since, and I bombed so bad. I'm like, yeah, because I had a fucking blunt force trauma to my leg, and I was still on stage. Did you say anything to the person? I was like, I just got hit by a car, guys. I came. No, back. the person that hit you. You didn't. You didn't yell at him. No, I did. Oh, okay. I don't want to retell the story. Oh, okay. You don't have to retell it. But yeah, that that sucks. Yeah. Getting hit by a car sucks. Yeah, it does. Takeovers uh, are fucking stupid, dude. What are? Takeovers. That's oh, what the what the, the takeover. yeah. I've never been. I've never really understood that shit. I never really got like why. Why is it cool to go fucking circle around? I mean, I get that. I guess we're shutting down the street, dude. Look at my car. Yeah, bro. And they all bring guns and they shoot each other and people die at those things. Really? Yeah. They, somebody will hit somebody and then, or somebody will crash into someone's car that's parked on the side and the guy gets mad and he'll pull a gun out and shoot the guy who crashed into his car. It's like, dude, you chose to be there. Remember the whole. You brought your car to that place, knowing that it could possibly happen, and then it did happen, <laughs> and then you killed this guy, or you started shooting a bunch of people. Yeah, you can look it up. There's a bunch of fucking people. Well, public freakout's pretty good. What's this? Yeah. Oh, this is another Christmas one that we pulled for you. We're kind of just rifling through stuff. This is an impromptu pod. We're just having fun, dude. We're just Christmas hanging, you know. Just wanted to fucking kick it with you. We've had a good year. Let's see what's this. Oh yeah, this is nice. Um Oh no. 
<laughs> oh shit! Oh my god, squaring up at the bath and bath body, and body works, work, dude. dude. Oh shit! Giving her that body work, boy. Sheesh! <laughs> Yo. Two black bitches duking it out in a white barn. I think That's that hilarious. was a black chick and a white chick. No way. <laughs> no way. Oh, no. no. It's two black chicks. It's like... Two black she, chicks fighting in a white barn. It's She must... There must have been some, like, previous conflict. That she was like, I'm going to show up to your work and beat your ass at work. That shit has to do that. <laughs> you see that, you see that fat lady just, yeah. like, duck? She was. That was the most athletic thing she did all year. Yeah, that's this fine. part right here. Whoop. <laughs> that slight shoulder dip. dip. Whoop. Floyd Mayweather. Oh, my God. There's, those are connecting. Oh, my God. Each one of those candles is like 40 bucks, dude. Just picture 40 bucks going down the drain every time one falls down. Oh, my God. That's crazy. At least they're $10 off. <laughs> Bitch. The sinister giggles of a camera <laughs> person. That's fucked. <laughs> that is fucked. Who goes to somebody's work like that? Wonder what I wonder what happened. Is there any backstory? No, it's just people talking shit. Man, I would love to know the backstory on that one. Um, what other Christmas fun? Reddit things? public freakouts. Oh yeah, this is you. a good this this looks like it happened in Portland to be honest. Like it actually looks like Portland. Oh. Oh shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Describe it for people that have this. this guy listen. swings on this guy swings on Santa Claus and hits some black ice. And <laughs> slides. Dude, that's so funny. Oh, all the oh, power. Shit. All the power that hit was oh, just taken shit. away. It's then, for some That's what you get for trying to sneak Yo, attack take Santa that Claus. Walk away, my boy. For some Oh, oh, oh shit. The, Santa's jacket oh, is coming off. Shit. This dude's jacked. Oh, he, he fucked with the wrong up scene. Now. He backing up. Dude, starting a oh. fight starting a fight in white pants is crazy. Oh! <laughs> Slip his slide! <laughs> Live his life. Oh, dude! Another Santa! Yeah. Another <laughs> Santa has joined in. A new challenger has approached. This dude is fucking getting jumped by Santa Claus. Is what a, this was at one of those Santa Con yeah, bar dude, crawls. Yeah, you fuck with one Santa, dude. You started. Oh many, my God! <laughs> too many IPAs and eggnog cocktails for these guys. For some reason, people fighting in Christmas gear is. Oh shit! <laughs> these guys are Let so go. drunk and dumb right now. Oh, dude! Swing and a miss, <laughs> literally, dude. My man is charging up those punches, but they're all doing like five damage. <laughs> He's missing so much. That is so funny. None of the power is transferring because it's slippery. Slip and slide. You can't get any grip. <laughs> oh, oh my shit. god. He like dude. cow tipped him Let over him that go. <laughs> Yeah, fighting in white pants is crazy, bro. That's the, a nice in, outfit. In the ice? Yeah, dude. So funny. Well, oh, this is a cl good classic here. Oh, no. I wonder how many people died because of those things. I wonder See, how many insurance claims those things caused. So we've got, we've got a, a white mother, uh, looks like, and she's doing a handstand on one of those little hoverboard things, and it goes backwards and destroys the Christmas tree and kind of ruins Christmas there a little bit. Oh, God. She kind of. I wonder how her back felt after that. Would you ever do something like that? Can you ride those? You ever ridden one yeah, of those? Yeah, uh, I learned. She was successful for a minute, though. It's actually kind of impressive. Yeah, I'm good at almost everything I try. I learned those within, like, five seconds. Yeah. I stepped on it. I was like, oh, how do you do it? Oh, okay. And yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's pretty cool. Oh, yeah, I got I'm this I'm not paying stuff. $300 for it. Yeah. I mean, it's pretty sweet. Little kids just zipping around those all the time. Oh, you're fucking up the curtains, dude. <laughs> See, that's why you can't have a hoverboard. That's dude. why I was pretending have... to be on one, and right. I started destroying shit. See we how can... destructive those are. We can never have one of those in here. I summoned the energy of actually <laughs> having one here. Yeah, you did. See how destructive that is? Just imitating the sheer concept of it, and I'm destroying curtains. And you're ruining the studio. Yeah, I'm fucking. Yeah, we can. We're not buying one of those. Put it back. <laughs> well, I just Taylor. Got, put I it just back. Got you one for Christmas. Put it back, Taylor. Uh, but it I back. want it. Put it the fuck back, dude. Okay, we already watched the new new uh, the freak out there. Um, I did pull this article just because I thought, <clears throat> you know, people want too much nowadays. And I just thought, you know, this was a little much. Um, emotional support alligator. 
Really? You're going to have an emotional support alligator? Yeah, these people are getting out of control. Their honestly. things are getting out of control, dude. They're not, you just want to bring animals places. <laughs> you just want to bring an alligator to a base. This yeah, is- and then and then they try to gaslight everybody there like they're crazy. No, dude, that's Jeff. <laughs> yeah, dude. It's- I need him for emotional support. Yeah, then go give him a hug. His name's Wally. Oh, of course. I knew it was some <laughs> fucking stupid shit. <laughs> Wally. Yo, I have his papers right here. Sir, it's a fucking alligator. Yeah, you go to your homeboy's house. Don't worry. He don't bite. It's a fucking alligator. Just <laughs> yeah, he's a, yeah, he's hissing at you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just take a seat, man. He don't... Yeah. If you leave him alone, he'll leave you oh, alone. Oh, that's just Wally. <laughs> <laughs> just don't look at him in the eye and leave your raw chicken at the door. Yeah, pretty much. Hey, yeah, put those... Uh, Put that... <laughs> put all those pounds of ground beef in that bag on the counter. And, uh, yeah. God really? damn, I gotta get my shit sorted out. That's all right. That's all right. Everything's falling apart. Dude, we're literally just hanging. This is the funniest, just silliest. Yeah, he don't Christmas bite. Pot. Yeah, he don't bite. <laughs> <laughs> what? They do that little throat growl. <laughs> the little fucking. Yeah, can I get somebody to watch my dog for a weekend? <laughs> <It's> like... <laughs> Wally is an emotional support animal to Joey Henny, who lives in the Harrisburg area. The pair got attention at a recent visit to South Philly. Philly's not real. It was just a misunderstanding. That's all it was, he said. No, you brought a fucking alligator to a baseball game. That's yeah. not a misunderstanding. White people shit. Yeah, dude, white that is people. some serious white people shit. I'll take uh, white people shit for 500, Alex. Jesus Christ. There Ooh. you go. Oh, yeah, this Ooh. is going to be you when you're 103, dude. Self-proclaimed sassy 103-year-old says beautiful women keep him going, dude. Let's cancel this motherfucker. (laughs) Yeah, exactly. I just wake up sassy, dude. (laughs) You're never too old to shake things up, dude. We got a little... He fought for our country. He can grab any ass he wants, dude. (laughs) He he fought in World War II, dude. He defeated the Nazis. He He can grab all the ass he wants. My brother? Five's favorite tie-dye wearing Lobby five. World War II veteran is celebrating a major milestone. Today is Ed Hendrickson's 103rd birthday. I got my hands on the hottest ticket in town, an invite to his party in Bangor. <laughs> this is what people in Maine are excited about, dude. Yeah. <laughs> the fucking ar- the uh, oldest man ever, his birthday party. is the- Fucking Bangor, Maine. All they do is smoke <laughs> weed and go rock climbing there. There's really nothing to do in Bangor, Maine, so yeah. It's the most boring birthday party ever. What are you talking about? That shit is lit. True. At 103 <laughs> years old, Ed Hendrickson proves you're never too old to shake things up. I looked at a paper and I saw one like it, so I thought I gotta have one of those. Dude, he has the hair so of a grandma. Morning fixing it. Sporting a new temporary do for his big <laughs> it's day. It's a wig. Ed held court oh, thank God. <laughs> he went, he went. <laughs> he went as a, as a woman. His big the day. first Ed held court as, at the celebration. Trans ma. He went as fucking Mrs. Doubtfire for his 103rd birthday, dude. His my trans ma. Ed held court at the celebration put on by his assisted living home. I just wake up sassy. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody's got a tran pa. <laughs> Somebody's got a fucking zesty. C. Alice. Somebody's got Somebody's a got zesty got a, ass grandpa. Yeah, dude. I just wake up sassy. Yeah. <laughs> Said the only 103-year-old man. Anyone who wants to follow in this 103-year-old's footsteps, Ed shared advice from the silly. What keeps you going? The love of beautiful women. Hell yeah, brother. He's just like, bitches keep me going, bro. The love of the game. (laughs) Yeah, exactly. (laughs) The fucking, you know, cut. (laughs) Cutter. (laughs) Potential cheeks. Dude. Getting dome in the fucking power wheelchair. (laughs) Getting popped off. (laughs) Yeah. <laughs> just a chick on her knees with her mouth open and he's just <laughs> the fucking 35% hard dick. <laughs> barely fucking barely a pulse flowing through the veins of it. How do you think you're going to be in there? Do you think you're going to go in a retirement home, dude? Uh I'm actually a uh, immortal. You're immortal. Yeah. So I'm going to be this age forever. You're going to look exactly like I got this bit song. by a vampire like two and a half weeks ago. So I, that's why I've been feeling like shit lately. Yeah. Mm. So I was like, oh, you've been wondering where I've been. But you've been looking younger and younger each day. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's been it's been a it's been quite the experience. It's interesting. Um 
What is this? Oh yeah, this one is this is a really funny video too. I thought this was cool. So uh, this guy, this announcer gets hit in the face with a hockey puck, uh, apparently. Bro. Oh, good down here, Dan. Oh, just trying okay. to clean my glasses up a little bit so I can put them on and see through them. Again. Are you gonna need stitches before we fly yeah, them yeah, on? It, it will be, but that's that's fine. But I can't. <laughs> Bro, my man is split. Bro, he got fucked up. I love the way that the interview starts. Just got to check in with Dan down there. Use my page anymore that I have my notes on because it's uh, kind of uh, littered it's in blood. Mess, yeah, uh, yeah we just kind of keep that to ourselves, but nothing less. Good to go. Nice. Normal guy would have been carried out of here. Hell yeah, what a fucking Chad. Call Normal him. guy yeah. would have been carried out yeah, of just here. Just check in on your Rob. Yeah, you, you can check in. I'm all, uh... <laughs> He's just trying his best not to cuss the guy out. Yeah, we could check in. I'm just bleeding profusely from my forehead with a little tampon between my eyes here. Yeah, my face is being held together with a piece All of... All good down on. here, Dan. My face is being held together with a piece of loose leaf. <laughs> it looks like a Zen pouch. Yeah, he just it. shoved a Zen in there. He's like, fuck it. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I can catch a quick buzz off of this, dude. Yeah, his third eye is definitely open. Pop a Zen in his down here, down forehead, forehead OC. I love that shit, Pop a Zen in his forehead OC real quick, dude. Um, so another reason I wanted to have you on here too, again, Michael, just so we can get in the, st the new stew and do a gore cast together in the yeah. new stew because I'm trying to get everybody to come back. But also, you have a podcast to promote now. Yeah. Yeah, we've been doing it. It's been a... It's, it's been fun. It's, it's been, been a journey. Good. It's been pretty good. Been having fun with it. Yeah. Uh, people are loving it. It's called... Radio Ridley Radio. R3. Ridley. R3. Radio. R3. You got to watch it. It's so good. Seriously, so good. The production quality is so good. The riffs awesome. are good. Taylor is such a such a great help, and he helps me get It's uh, really just you doing your own thing, brother. But, dude, the riffs are wild. The riffs have been hot. Riffs in the wild. Riffs in the wild. Um, I thought it might be fun, and you can put the kibosh on this because you've heard these a bunch of times already, but I thought it would be fun for people that listen to this podcast <clears throat> if we showed them some of the drops that we made. Ooh, Tony, play the drops. Has, has uh, Tony ever heard any of these? Tony has heard some, but not as much as we've listened to them. So, um, let's listen to the drops, dude. You're gonna get uh, uh, Gorecast listeners. You're gonna you're gonna laugh. These are fun. I had a lot of fun making these, dude. They're so fucking stupid. We're gonna make more of them. It's really fun. Um, here, I'll let Tony just pick these at random from back there. We use, uh, or I guess you need the computer, so that's fine. Yeah, you can just like start picking these and going through them. Um, so yeah, we basically just mic'd Ridley up, put some effects on his voice, and uh, we had some fun with like some radio style drops. Maybe we can come up with some more ideas for summer and write them down on this podcast. This one's called No Pussies. Oh, don't yeah. Yo. Hmm. Um. You don't have to tell us the name. It's fine. Ridley Radio. No pussy ass shit allowed. That's a good one. That's and that's just true. Yeah, no pussy shit allowed. No man. pussy shit allowed on your podcast. No dude. pussy shit, dude. No, no pussy shit allowed. You're listening to Radio Ridley Radio. Speak English. <laughs> I love <laughs> how you one. I love how you lose it at the end of that one. You can, yeah, even, you can hear me hear play it again, dude. <laughs> you can hear me fucking break at the end because it was so <laughs> it felt racist. It's as super fuck. racist. It felt racist. You're listening to Radio Ridley Radio. Speak English. <laughs> <laughs> you <can hear> it. <laughs> You're like old man minor laugh, dude. The hottest riffs in the city, Radio Ridley Radio. That one's pretty sick. I that like one, that one. That one is good. I just picture like a skyline of Austin. Yeah. And then fucking like Vice City font. Radio yeah, yeah, Ridley yeah. Radio. 66.6 .6 FM. It's Radio Ridley Radio. The number one live Christian podcast. <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember adding the Christian at yeah. the end. Got a Christian cast? Yeah, dude. Okay. It is a Christian podcast, yeah. Perfect combo. Oh yeah, we need to we need to use these more on your podcast when you're like it's just it's hard for me cuz I don't want to like disturb your fucking Yeah, 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 like yeah. riffing with a fucking drop and that's like you if can I wait, step you I feel like if you gave it like a beat like let me rip the combo and then yeah. if, it, if if I'm like you know, you'll see it. You'll see the dissociation where I'm like all right, I can't think of anything left. There's nothing left. So you, it's this. riff 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 and then Tony. Oh. Home. 
perfect combo. Yeah, like one of that timing. Like, <laughs> yeah. yeah, you gotta have like yeah, you gotta have like fucking. The, it is the the comedic timing yeah. of the drops. You gotta, I got it, and I don't want to. I'm nervous about it. My fingers nah, all you shaking. Gotta, you gotta know when to do it. I know. I know what you mean though. I don't want to screw it up. Disgusting, disgusting combo. <laughs> yeah. Dude, you literally sound like a Street Fighter announcer. Yeah. It's fucking perfect. I want to be a voice actor. All right, you're listening to Radio Ridley Radio. No liberals allowed. <laughs> Whoa, that was weird. I don't I don't remember doing that one. Boo. That was I don't think that was me. <laughs> Wait, go back uh go to that one. Yeah. Up up Yep, center. You're listening to Radio Ridley Radio. Go back to your country. <laughs> That's a wild one, isn't it? Yeah. Oh my goodness. Who is that? Who, Who said that? Fuck? Who the fuck said that? Dude? Yeah, dude, let's get some lights on, dude. Yeah. <laughs> Here, give us that one again, dude. <laughs> yeah. yeah. You're listening to Radio Ridley Radio. Go back to your country. <laughs> so silly. Dude. This is crazy. That is crazy. It's a crazy ass swear. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. Oh, yeah, that's a classic. Damn, son, who shit on our porch? <laughs> <laughs> no, but seriously, my dad's pissed. <laughs> yeah. Guys, for real, who the who put the flaming bag <laughs> far, of shit? Far left, far left. <laughs> nice, nice cock. <laughs> I don't even know why you recorded that one. All right, go to when the are we going right. to use that top one? Top right, top right. Nice <laughs> cock. <laughs> <laughs> and then I wonder what the, the one to the left of that one would do. Nice cock. Oh, sick. So there's like different octaves. There's of different, nice. Yeah. nice cock. Nice cock. Nice cock. You should get one layered. Like all <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Oh. Nice. nice. Yeah, yeah, there you yeah, go. Yeah. There you go. Jesus Christ. Yeah. What is that one? What is that one? Jesus Christ. Christ. Where'd you find this riff? <laughs> wow, that's that's a, crazy. That's a good one, dude. <laughs> dude, you got a good voice for radio, dude. That's why you're. That's why it's too bad. Radio it's a, too bad. Radio. It's a dead media, and we're bringing it back to life only on Radio Ridley Radio, baby. And yeah, the Gorecast. The Gorecast. And the fucking Gorecast. We should record, do a metal song to get like a, some oh, funny yeah, metal song funny together, metal song. and then we can you like I'll we do can, like the high pitch vocals. We can right? write like funny lyrics, like break down things mm-hmm. to say. Like I'll send you a video. There's this dude, Andrew Baina. Um, from this, he used to be in this band called Galactic Pegasus. I don't know if they're still around, but uh, he's like a meme king of fucking metal or whatever, and yeah. does a bunch of <clears throat> videos where it's like him screaming like pickup lines and stuff like that with his buddy, and they just take turns. We should definitely do some funny shit like that. Fuck yeah, dude! Give us the BLM one, dude. Oh yeah, yeah, do do hit BLM. That one's funny. Lives matter only on Radio Ridley Radio. Run it back again. Yeah, run it one more time. Black Lives Matter, only on Radio Ridley Radio. So, yeah, see, we, we leveled it out. We <laughs> I said that only Black Lives Matter here. So if you're not listening, you're racist. Right. That's a good way to do it. It's a good smart. way to gaslight them into listening to your Pretty podcast. No, 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 no. Not gaslighting. I'm just spitting facts. Right. You're just, just telling facts. the truth. Yeah. If you want to be an ally, you have to listen to Radio Ridley Radio. Dude. Of course. It's, a, it's an Asian-owned business. It's <laughs> here, go, go up to the, it's a what? It's a oh, yeah. it's minority Asian. owned business. Yeah, it's a minority owned business. If you're not supporting it, then you're just racist. And, and it's so obvious. It's just so fucking obvious. Dude. Yeah, dude. Let's get a couple more of these. Uh, he sweat. Oh, nice. I think if you hit space bar, if you click it and then hit space bar, it'll like pull up a better preview. Okay. Is it hot in here, or are you just listening to Radio Ridley Radio with Chinky Sweat? That's like a halfway through the podcast one. You just, yeah. When I go take a piss. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Is it hot in here? Or yeah, if I start sweating and I'm like, yo, can we turn the AC down? Because we will oh, no, eventually, hit, hit, we will eventually hit, hit, do it again. Uh, hit water. Hit water. Get a bottle of water for your sweaty ass. Oh, yeah, when I go, to get, when I go grab a water. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, dude. It's been so much fun making this fucking podcast with you, brother. Oh, I'm having you. so much thank fun. We're so just getting much. started too. We, I think we had a good, I think it's been a good year, you know. Probably one of my best years in comedy in in life in general. Yeah. yeah. What are some things that you're stoked on that happened that were fun? Uh, five paychecks from mothership. Five. Shh, let's go. Five paychecks from That's the sick. comedy mothership. And you, uh, so does that mean you went up five times, or is there? Yeah, I did five paid gigs there. Is there? That's there, pretty. That's a lot more than some people in this town. Yeah, that's so huge. That's, that's, I've only been here Good for job, a buddy. year, and then 
becoming like a prominent person in roast battle mm -hmm. like i fucking get recognized for roast battle all the you're time you're on like all of like, like so half many of those videos on their the, youtube channel well, yeah a lot of their youtube videos I'm, I'm on it fuck dude crushing dogs Just started a pod yeah started a pod sold some t-shirts let's go been on kill tony like five times this year year and a half year and a half last year and a half damn. fucking dude it's Dude, yeah, I'm doing I'm doing pretty good. You're doing good. You gotta you gotta give yourself some props once in a while. I know getting you gotta book, keep you gotta you can't gigs. rest on your laurels and you gotta keep your grind going. And having always having something to do. Like I got yeah. a show after this. Right. I gotta run to a show after this. You gotta That's run cool. to a show. What's uh is there any shows happening that you can promote? Because this is gonna come out tomorrow. We're gonna oh, push this out tomorrow. Let's go to, uh, go to Black and Mild at Sunset Strip is Cam Patterson's show. I'm on that one next next week, the twenty seventh. Right after Christmas, y'all come hang. If you're in Austin, come, come hang. Out. If you're in okay. Austin, Texas, December 27th, we're going to be at the Sunset Strip doing the Black and Mild Comedy Showcase. That's Cam Patterson, yeah. regular of the Kill Tony Show. Dude, look at, look at you. We're pl you're plugging dates on a podcast? We're, Whoa. You got to fucking just... I'm so sleepy. Do the thing, dude. It's, yeah. those, it's dude, those gringas coming back to get dude, you, dude. the gringas, dude. Yeah, we had two gringas. I had two gringas before we started the pod. Man, I'm getting sleepy. <laughs> like we? You fucking hate those, bro. I crushed I them. watched you hammer I'm about those. to fucking squeeze them out in the bathroom in a second, dude. <laughs> Holy shit, bro. My fucking booty hole's about to be speaking Spanish here in a second. Andale, andale, mami, ia, ia, oh, oh. I'm shitting the night. I'm fucking full of food right now. <laughs> dude. I'm so sleepy. Hit the new character unlocked, yeah, yeah. dude. Nelly. <laughs> just yeah. fucking new character unlocked. Just Nelly. Just we do a pod. We should do a pod with band aids on our face. On Nelly's birthday, we'll do a Nelly. Yeah. A Nelly yeah, let's pod. Do a Nelly, Nelly episode, dude. We Fuck can turn that. the heat up. <laughs> so hot. <laughs> Is it getting hot in here? Just butt, two dudes, butt ass naked, sitting across from each other at a table. Just like, man, it, why did we do this? <laughs> sweating like Ace Ventura and the Rhino. Oh, dude, that was a legendary scene. That was fucking legendary. Underlay, you have a, you mommy, have a, yeah, you yeah. Have a favorite uh, Christmas movie? My favorite Christmas movie is that Arnold, Sw Ar Arnold Schwarzenegger <clears throat> movie with Jingle Turbo. All the way, Jingle dude. All the Way. Jingle All the Way. Yep. Jingle All the Way. Turbo Man! Yeah, Turbo Man, and then fucking Sinbad. Sinbad is the fucking... Dude, Sinbad, Sinbad was, was the, the postman. Guy. He was the postman in that dude, movie. Dude, pull up a picture of Sinbad from Jingle All the Way. Yeah, dude, dude he was a dick. He was like his. He was, he was his homie, but he was also his enemy. He and he like, was crazy too. Yeah, like he, he was lost it. At he the was end. trying to get. Yeah, he was trying to get the fucking Turbo Man for his son too. So it was like Jingle All the Way. And remember, they're trying to hand out the shitty pink like mammoth doll thing. No, we don't want that. We don't want no. We don't want thing. the fucking sidekick. We want Turbo Man. This motherfucker is a menace, dude. He was a menace. Click that one right there in the middle next to the poster. Oh, um, yeah, he was the villain. <laughs> at the he end. was the villain at the end of the oh, final yeah, battle. Dude. That's so funny. What was the villain's name, dude? His that, name was Virgil in the show. That's so fucking funny that his brain is, like, encapsulated in glass. <laughs> I think that's just such a funny, like... <laughs> it's like a rip on, like, uh, on Magneto or some shit, Yeah, too. yeah, yeah. He was a menace, dude. <laughs> Turtle Man. Dementor. Dementor, that's what it was. <laughs> dude, that sticker goes hard, actually. Ta-ta, Turtle Man! <laughs> <laughs> dude, I'm going to go home and watch this shit. It's like one of the best Christmas... This might be one of my favorite Christmas movies, Yeah, too. I think it's the... Like, I don't really like Christmas movies, but Jingle All the Way and The Santa Claus, the first original Santa Claus with Tim Allen. I love what a piece of shit Arnold Schwarzenegger is in that movie. Like, he's just like the piece of shit overworking dad. Yeah, of course. He, like, tells his wife, like, I'll be home, money, and he goes, and remember, you're my number one customer, because he just, like, says that to everybody on the phone. <laughs> and his wife's like, like, oh, dude, and then the, uh, the creepy fucking what's that uh comedian who passed away um really phil hartman is in that movie yeah and he plays like the rapey neighbor <laughs> what you i don't, don't remember? remember no here pull up phil hartman jingle all the way he's like the neighbor that's like you deserve so much better than like arnold schwarzenegger <laughs> oh yeah when phil hartman is trying to steal yeah, arnold schwarzenegger's bitch. you're in my house with my wife eating my cookies <laughs> Is that actually That's in, the, a line, yeah. in the movie? Yeah, dude. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah remember? Yeah. yeah. My wife has worked with a bunch of scumbags like that. There's always that. There's oh, I always forgot about dude. the Santa fight in the warehouse with all the black market Santas. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> he had to escape. Yeah, he had to. He had to Andre like... the Giant. Is that oh, Andre is that the Giant? Really? No. No way. Dude, is that Andre the Giant? And then Vern Troyer? Oh, yeah. Is that... Yeah, little Vern, dude. 
Chill with the goatee. Look at the zoom, <laughs> zoom in on the goatee. Tony, <laughs> Tony, just, just zoom in. Just like I don't think that'll work. You got to go back. Just zoom in with the pad. <laughs> <laughs> he looks like a GameStop employee. Yeah, he does. Dude. <laughs> just a dickhead at GameStop. He's been there for too long. For yeah. twenty years. Yeah, I remember when Halo 3 came out. It was crazy. <laughs> a release party at midnight. He's standing on a little stool. like. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna, I can get the best I can do for those 60 games. It's $14. Yeah, fuck you, Vern Troyer. <laughs> Rest in peace, dude. Dude, yeah, he's dead, too. Mini-me, uh, dude. We're getting old, man. That's all right. Rest in peace, mini-me. Fuck, Vern We're getting Troyer. old, dude. Drake's about to do a country album. We're getting old. <sighs> this is weird. <laughs> Life is weird. Oh, I like the moose. I like what you've done here with the Yeah, moose. I put them up there, dude. I like I like these a lot. This is like really nice. Little miniature stuff. I like little stuff like that. Yes, dude. My grandpa you, made these. Your, no, he did not. No, he didn't. These are cheap ass fucking <laughs> Target. You got these from Target. <laughs> I don't know where they came from, to be honest. Where'd you get these? Sarah just fucking threw them in. She's like, this will be cute. It's like, babe, I need to I need to make the podcast cute. Help me. It does look very nice in here. I like what you've Thanks, done dude. with it, man. Got you some cookies too. Yeah, the cookies are that's probably that's probably my uh Make sure, Chelsea, Best make sure Chelsea gets, so gets some of those. Oh, yeah, for sure. Chelsea will definitely get some of these. Oh, yeah. I'm going to have her steal the recipe, and we're going to put you out of fucking business. Whoa. <laughs> Easy. Let's band together, dude. <laughs> as far as the cookie game goes, <laughs> you're you're out. <laughs> there's not enough room in this town for the bookings. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to put you guys in the fucking ground. <laughs> No, <laughs> wait, no, that was your moose. So, yeah, that's a visual representation of you versus me in the cookie game. <laughs> you motherfucker. Did you knock over my moose, dude? <laughs> Holy shit, dude. Dude, I was just. That's uh, Jesse, dude. Dude, I was at Ross getting these fucking sweaters before we came here. It's a fucking yeah. nightmare in, the, in the, those You went places. to Ross? I went to Ross, dude. I thought you got these at Walmart. I went to Walmart and they were picked over. All they had was like, damn. All they had scalped. was scalped, dude. Scalped. These are at Ross. These were too. from Ross. Yeah, they're pretty. That's lit. why they're nicer. That's why they're a little nicer. They're like way nicer than the shitty Walmart ones. Dude. Yeah, this dude. one's got a fucking. I have to change the batteries in this bitch. You do actually. You ever had a sweater you had to change the batteries in, dude? No, I didn't think so, dude. <laughs> it's pretty sick though, dude. This does this not make you want to go home and watch Jingle all the way? Yeah, I know, but I got that show. Yeah, so Chelsea's at work. I think she watched it. The other night, I think I was leaving the house and Jingle All the Way was on the TV. Oh, yeah, and I didn't want to leave. I was like, fuck. "Fuck, I love Jingle All the Way." Dude, do you get the uh, like end of the year fuck it's at all? Cause I get I'm this, in it right now. I, I get this bad like in <clears throat> end of the year like I don't want to do anything. I don't like cr- like I never stopped going on Christmas break mentally. Like I'm nope. still a child in my head when it comes to Christmas time. I'm like, yep. don't talk to me. Right. Well, Taylor, we have to wrap it up soon, brother. Yeah, I know. I know. We're, we got to wrap it up, bro. We're 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 pretty much done. Um. Plug the podcast. Let people know where to find you. Dude, Chinky Sweat on Instagram. Chinky Sweat on YouTube. Radio Ridley Radio. Google it. Uh, Michael Ridley. Google it. Fucking Google me, baby. It's crazy. I'm up there. We're out there. We're, We're doing, doing it. shit. We're doing shit. I just sent you a fucking fire ass <clears throat> set that I... I destroyed Sunset last night. Holy fuck, I destroyed we're gonna, Sunset. Strip. We're going to cut it up. Clip it I up. I sent you the fucking link, dude. I'm gonna I, need, just, I still need to watch it. I want to see it. We can watch it right after this. Fuck yeah, dude. Well, All thank right, you buddy. for having me again. Of course. Dude. Merry, and Merry Christmas, fucking, dude. Yeah, Merry fucking Christmas. Merry Christmas, buddy. I'm grateful, for, I'm grateful for our friendship. Me too. I'm grateful for you too. Thanks for doing this with me. And I wanted to do something fun for Christmas. So I'm taking this moose. Don't take my moose. <laughs> you can take, every, take everything from me, but you leave me my moose. <laughs> <laughs> you can take everything. Everything from it, but you leave my goddamn meese. <laughs> my meeses. <laughs> leave my meese behind. All right, run that outro. Let's do it, Tony. Your cast.